All right, so I only got five minutes to record this real quick. Just so you know, my camera function on my iPhone is fucked up right now. But I have this T-Pain app, which allows you to record videos, and for some reason, that's working. So that's what I'm using. Don't think I'm getting too fancy or anything with the effect. It's just the only thing I can use. Um, I'm making this video real quick because I've decided that I'm going to start studying with the witnesses again. Uh, obviously, not to go back, because that's uh, physically, mentally and esoterically impossible for me to do but um, it's more so so I can actually start getting the watchtowers on a regular basis um, um, a lot of new articles and watchtowers have been coming out and they're really interesting slash really disturbing and I need to get my hands on them and the best way to do that is to have them deliver them to you and since no witnesses have actually stopped at my door in the past almost two years that I've been living here, other than the two who were sent to us when we first moved, um, this is the way I'm going to have to do it to get them. I know they'll probably come around this month because it's the Memorial Month and they love to promote that campaign. But um, I actually have some, qual some qualms about that as well, but that's later. Um, so I'm going to go to the website and request a Bible study. Um, I'm also making this video to request that if anyone has the uh, What the Bible Really Teaches book, I'd, I'd really like a copy of it. If someone could like either send me a PDF or something like that. Because um, I've been watching Mike Atheist videos and he's been really patient with these witnesses and that was kind of the things that was one of the things that I didn't think I'd be able to do is be patient with them because um, I'd want to get to all the big hard hitting questions right away but um, I think it'd be nice to actually take my time and kind of see what they have to say and then say what I have to say and what I'm actually going to do is just actually follow the uh, the guidelines or you know the structure of the book I want to see if we can get all the way through the book, actually. I doubt that'll happen, but, you know, it's a nice little project that I'm working on right now. I'm bored, you know, so this is what I'm going to do uh, until the baby comes. Um, so, yeah, if anybody has that book, uh, like, send it to me, like, in a PDF or something, that'd be awesome. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm going to be doing. If y'all have any, like, suggestions as far as questions to ask them or... Uh, scriptures to show them because you know they're very systematic in what they do so even though there are certain questions and scriptures that are outlined there in the book um, when you ask certain questions they're going to bring up specific scriptures to combat those questions and they're more or less usually the same ones all the time and I've actually been reading my Bible a little bit for the past couple of days. I actually read six books of the Bible in one day. And it's amazing that just in those quick six books, um, it like goes against 85% of what they teach already. And it's just amazing that I wish that I actually read the Bible when I was younger around the witnesses. And I maybe could have freed some people a lot earlier before they got so deep and convoluted. But anyways... Okay, I got about a minute left. Um, so yeah, I'm posting this video. If y'all have any questions you don't want me to ask them, any scriptures you want me to combat them on, I'm trying to do this for a while, so it's not like I'm going to rush it all in one session or one sitting. I'm going to try to take my time with this and drag it out for as long as possible. And um, I'll videotape as many of them as I, as I can. The ones that I can't videotape, I will audio record. That's probably a little bit easier for me to do. Probably not as interesting for y'all to watch, but you'll still get the information and the experience. And for those who've never studied with Jehovah's Witnesses, you'll get to see um, their tactics, how they shy away from answering certain questions, how they'll try to switch the topic, and there's certain things like that. Alright, so that's my time. It's your man, Big Daddy Badass. Holla at your boy.